Hello, my name is Gift Egrinu. I'm a front end developer at Passionate People. I will be showing you what a typical day in my life as a front end developer, as a remote front end developer, because right now I am working remotely from Lagos, Nigeria. So, yeah, this video is basically going to tell you or show you what my routine daily routine looks like and how what I get up to on a daily basis for work I today I'll be working on a couple of things actually I'm doing this video alongside working on different um, tasks that I have assigned today I'm going to be working on a product up website product up is one of our events that we're putting together for startups and entrepreneurs that are interested and is happening in october so if you would like to know more about that event um, check it out so i'm working on some part of the websites that requires updating today i'm also doing a bit of work on another section of the website uh, i will show you what i what i i'll show you what that is in a bit and then I also have a couple of research to do in terms of um, a different client's projects that I'm working on. So I'll be doing all of this today and I have a couple of meetings. I already had stand up earlier. So yeah, I usually have stand up by 8.45, which is um, 9.45 in Amsterdam. But yeah, it's one hour behind time schedule for between me and my team so it really is a great time zone difference i guess i already have a routine that has helped me stay very productive and i tend to like improve it with every chance that i get so one of the routines that i have for now is working from a different room than where i would usually sleep so i have this small um i have this small room where it's different from where I sleep so every morning I dress up have my bag dress up come upstairs and walk then when it's time for um, yeah when when I'm done when I'm done with work I close off I don't take my laptop downstairs because I tend to overwork when I do that so I just keep my laptop here go downstairs do a couple of other activities that I usually do in the evenings like read a book or watch a YouTube video or watch Netflix. I really like watching Netflix. Something else that I've done that really helps me with working uh, from home is um, setting time like having a schedule. So if I have meetings, I block that in my calendar. If I want to have lunch, I have like I'll be I'll be I'll be very honest with lunch is quite difficult because I always forget to eat lunch but for breakfast I usually have breakfast in the morning before coming upstairs or when I'm here I'll go and make breakfast but for lunch I usually skip lunch sometimes and then just eat dinner so it's a couple of things that I have tried but some of them I stick to some of them I can't stick to so I just keep going as long as i stay productive that's like everything that i've done to help improve my productivity was a game changer with Rachel every week on Wednesday to discuss content marketing specifically for tech and in this meeting we were talking about this video in particular that I mentioned that I will be creating and a couple of other things as well. We use Notion for managing our projects. I picked up a ticket yesterday that I was working on which involved me adding a new section on the product of websites listing the speakers companies 
so i currently finished that tax but my manager suggested a better approach for implementing that and i've gone ahead to create a new ticket now i'm working on a quick bug fix on the front end love website one of the youtube videos in the media grid is not working it's not playing so i am checking that out right now on storyblock which is what we use for managing content and fixing the link to the youtube video and making sure it works as expected So I did some work and my manager just reviewed it and left some comments for me which I would go back to do right now so that's what I'm currently doing uh, he also left a couple of comments on some other cards so I'll check those ones as well so currently I'm fixing a comment that was made on one of my PRs, which is to make the grid on mobile look more responsive so instead of having them all displayed in one line have them in a grid three times grid so it looks better on mobile so that is what I'm currently doing I switched to a different project that we're working on not a different project per se still related to conferences uh, this one it's a attendee ticket workflow that we're trying to build for our attendees whereby when they sign up they get a mail with a ticket that they can share on social media so we are currently using building this with Netlify functions and I'm working with this alongside my colleagues. By the way, right now it is 3.34. So by now I would have probably had lunch, but I haven't. So I would just try to make something quickly and go back to work. So for lunch today, I'll be having noodles. Just coming in here to say that I usually do afternoon walks when I feel like not every time because I, f I discovered that I spend over 12 hours just sitting here and it's really no good for my health so I try to do like walk around the house sometimes I usually forget to do this but something that I think would be helpful is setting an alarm that go goes off at a specific time and I can just do it at that point because I feel like being active is really helpful which I find out that I'm currently not active so I want to do that I would make more efforts to do that hi so it's 
actually 6 p.m. so it's 6 p.m. and I close out by 6 I was able to do a couple of things that I have assigned and planned to do at the beginning of the day what I would get up to now is either read a book which I usually do when I close out from work not here obviously I'll go downstairs do that but instead of doing that today I'm thinking of actually editing so the videos that I made today I want to compile them together and edit them so yeah I would probably do that now or tomorrow either ways so that wraps up a day in my life hope you enjoyed watching it